All right, Andrew, I've got the fin wolf here. Why don't you explain a little bit about it? Well, the fin wolf is a Puko design. It has a Scandi grind. This is real popular with the outdoorsmen and um, bushcrafters. It's a knife that usually takes a lot of abuse, a lot of hard cutting and, and whittling and preparing for fire, so it needs to be durable. Should mm -hmm. we test it? Yeah, let's go. So this is our standard setting for impact tests. Go ahead. It's number one. Three. Last one. So that's a pass. That's a pass. Great. Three. The last one. Five. It's about a 98%, I would say, but that's still. still you could still use it if you had to. Yeah. It's, I mean,. That actually, the last one took a little more out of it when I opened it, so it's self-adjusting, but it's like outstanding. Yeah. I've got the ultimate bushcraft folder, the Finwolf. Why don't you tell us about it? Okay, we have a full plastic frame, and the key to the bushcraft, Robert, as you know, is the Scandi grind. That's what you want if you're gonna do all the bushcrafting chores. And simplicity is the overall, you know, idea with bushcraft and the bushcraft tools. So let's just see this, how this knife holds some weight. There's no steel in the handle other than, again, the pocket clip. And fingers. Yep. So we put it in here. We're gonna go for the 100 pounds. Robert, this is a, a three and a half inch blade. Come up a little bit here. Okay. There we go. 100 pounds. 3.4 ounce knife. For a good working order. So 100 pounds is a great result. Double? Yeah, we're pretty, we're pretty far past the standard uh, hold. I think that's about it. 
it. Yeah. You? No, I, would, I would call that. That's I, way past 